Chico Unified Schools are back in session, but there was pretty unhealthy air quality all across that area today. Action News Now reporter Ryan Ketchum is live at Chico High School. So, Ryan, did the... Yes, it did, Alan and Haley. Uh, Chico High actually had to cancel its outdoor practices today, including football. And I actually saw one of their teams just doing some light, very light, that is, workouts and then going back inside to finish everything up. Now, it may not look too smoky or smell too smoky exactly in the area that I am right now. You do see some of the haze in the top corner of your screen right here. But purple air says that this air right now is unhealthy. This is the air quality map from about 30 minutes ago. Chico is red and nearing purple, meaning unhealthy to very unhealthy. And so if, if levels were, were to stay in the unhealthy range for an extended period of time, um, activities such as recess, um, we would recommend if air quality was un, un, in the unhealthy range to keep indoors. A layer of smoke could be seen around the whole city today. South of here near Orville and Gridley also had unhealthy air. But parents and students in Chico did not let the smoke bring down their excitement, as this will be the first time that students don't have to wear masks at the start of a semester since spring 2020. Um, I feel like it feels like normal again, you know, like for the last uh, three years, I felt really, um, I, I feel sad for the kids that having to have masks on when they're playing outside going in the classroom but it feels like you're free like again so it feels amazing because well you can pretty much just do everything normally again some parents and students still think people should wear a mask if they're sick it scares me that there's a possibility that there could be so there could be somebody that's sick that's deciding not to wear a mask Chico Unified Schools still offer masks to all students and faculty. I actually got this from walking right into the main office here at Chico High School. So if you're a student or if you're a staff member and you still feel comfortable wearing a mask, they still offer them to you. Reporting live in Chico, I'm Ryan Ketchum. Action News Now coverage you can count on. Thank you, Ryan. A Red Bluff and Chico schools are now in session. Paradise, Reading, and Oroville will start back up this week.